it's pretty simple actually. The email option that they give you is a complete link. When people click on that link, they get sent to PayPal to check out. You can then adhere or attach that link to um, image buttons on your website. You can send it out in a tweet. You can put it, you know, attach it to anything because it's operating uh, as a standalone link. It doesn't have any sort of image already attached to it. It doesn't come with a PayPal button. It is just a link to your to the checkout portion for that product in PayPal. Okay. The other option where they actually give you this form data right here is all of the code necessary to actually put in a image button hosted by PayPal on PayPal servers and it's in the form or the code form of uh, an actual form. Now there's no fields like to type in your name and your email but it, that's the code used is actually a form and so it does not have the same capabilities as a link. Uh, 